What's up, folks? This is your boy Z The Real here. And right now, I'm going to tell you something about this um, Colin Kaepernick character, right? This Colin Kaepernick player they're getting ready to add back on Madden. Now, y'all, for those who've been uh, subscribed to the channel, y'all know how I feel about Colin Kaepernick, right? Y'all, I told y'all, nah, y'all know how I feel. I've covered this already, right? But Madden is trying to stoop low. Okay, Madden has stooped completely low. And this is why Madden has stooped low, because they know they screwed up already. Madden already know, like Madden 21 is already proven to be one of the worst Maddens of all time. Like out of all other Maddens, they've had in like the last like 25 something years. This is amongst the worst of them, right? This game already started off with too many bugs and glitches, right? They couldn't even do the Tennessee Titans logo correctly. Right? They got they they got the Titans sharing the logo with the Vikings, which is completely disrespectful, right? But these dudes want to sit here and lie on Colin Kaepernick. Now I'm gonna tell you off the top, man. I'm here to tell you that EA actually doesn't watch football at all. Nobody from EA Sports watches the uh, the actual uh, sport they work on. And I'm going to tell you why, right? Actual evidence. Because see, before they added Colin Kaepernick, they did not do their research at all. They was not watching football in the last four years. This is the same man that when the NFL gave him another opportunity to try to uh, work out, right, at least... For a, for a scout to check him out and look at him, right? For, so he can get picked up by a team in January. This dude going to change the workout to a high school. And then after the workout was over, watch which he worked out with nobody from the NFL at all. This dude going to try to say, go tell all 31 owners or tell all 32 owners and watch you get able to stop running and hiding, right? We all seen that, okay? I'm going to tell you this now. Colin Kaepernick actually doesn't care about playing football anymore. He don't. And I'm going to show you why, right, towards the end of this video. But let me show you something, right? So... Now, again, this is what Eric Ray rather posted on his video, right? And this is just the new update. It says Colin Kaepernick is one of the, they say Colin Kaepernick is one of the top free agents in football and a starting caliber quarterback. I'm going to tell you right now off the top that that's a, a pure lie. They're only doing this so they can get people into the game. They only do this so you get more people buying the game, right? They don't care about ratings. They don't care that this man had three bad seasons before he took that knee, right? They don't care about none of that stuff, Right? They don't care that Colin Kaepernick disrespected the Baltimore Ravens, right? The Miami Dolphins, none of them teams, right? That teams gave him opportunity. He didn't, he didn't um, sign with him. They don't care about none of this. Let me show y'all something really quick, right? And, I, and I'm going to show you that this is a lie. For one, dude, let's look at the, let's look at the free agency, right? So now, this is the tracker. These are the quarterbacks, right? These are all the quarterbacks who currently got signed, right? Or franchise tied, right? Derek Prescott, Tanya got signed, right? Let me show you all these quarterbacks, right? Now, James, these are all quarterbacks who currently got signed. But I'm going to show you these free agents. Uh, Newton just got picked up, received by the uh, by the Patriots. Why? Right? Dalton is a cowboy. So these are all teams, right, that got signed. All current. Uh, these are the uh, I'm not, these are the current uh, NFL free agents, right? They are quarterbacks. Okay. So Flacco just got signed by Jess. Eli Manning retired. But look at Matt. We got Matt Moore, Brandon Allen, Brian Horder, who just got signed by New England, Colt McCoy. Giants, right? Blake Bortles, Brett Hundley is with Arizona. Chase Daniels with Detroit. AJ McCarron, Houston. Got Dref, uh, Driscoll. He's with Denver. Joe Well is still a free agent. They signed Nick Stuffield. One year, two million with Philadelphia. Trevor Simeon. Look at Josh McGowan, 40 years old. Geno Smith. One year with the Seattle Seahawks. Blaine Gabbert. One year with Tampa Bay. Kyle Storter, PJ Walker. Two year, um, two year, one and uh, one point uh, five, yeah, one point five and sixty five million deal with Carolina. Jordan Tamil, T yeah, Tamu, six eight is six hundred eighty thousand with KC. Mike Glennon with Jacksonville. Drew Stanton, Chad Haney signs with KC. David uh, Flays with um, the New York, uh, the New York Jets, and then Sean Mannion. One year with the Minnesota Vikings, right? So that's all the, the free agents, right? Now let's look at the top free agents. Now we're going to look at the current NFL top, uh, 2020 top 15 free agents remaining, right? This is according to NBC, okay? So you got Jadamian Clowney, Devontae Freeman, Jason Peters, Kevin Beecham, Everson Griffin, Logan Ryan, Marcus Golden, Larry Warford, Jordan Reed, we got Michael Bennett at 11th, 
Damon Harrison. Akeem Talib, another veteran right there at 13. He's only 34 years old. Look, his boy Eric Reed, safety, right? Panthers released him. And by the way, Eric Reed did nothing to put Colin Kaepernick back on the Panthers. This dude did nothing to return Colin Kaepernick and try to get him signed by Carolina at all. Nothing. It was either A, Cam Newton wasn't having it, or B, this dude didn't really care, man. This dude was just trying to uh, make the so-called white man look bad, but he was collecting the white man's paycheck. I told you, man, this dude, Eric Reed, is a freaking clown, dude. That's all he is, doing it for attention. And then we got Tony Jefferson at 15. So that's it. No Colin Kaepernick at all. He's not a top 15 free agent. He's not a top agent at all, right? Madden is lying. Clearly they lying, right? Now let me show y'all something here, right? Now we're going to look at his career stats, right? This is why he hasn't been signed on a football team officially. This ain't got, first of all, the man was never a black ball, right? I don't want nobody else come on my video saying he's black ball. If the man was black ball, right, how come his name was being brought up for the last four years? How come, right, the Seattle Seahawks called him in for an interview, right? The Baltimore Ravens and the Miami Dolphins all talked about signing him. How come the Broncos tried to offer him a, um, an offer if he was really black ball? No, he, the man wasn't black ball because he took a knee. He wasn't black ball, period. If the man didn't openly, if Kaepernick never said out of his own mouth that I was black ball, Right? He wasn't blackballed at all. Okay, remember, the man saddled out of court that never bring up being blackballed again. So, no, that wasn't a blackball. It, it's, again, if he was a really blackball, he could have took that with the court and let the judge decide. So, that wasn't the case anymore. So, y'all can't say he was ever blackballed. But this is why this man ain't been taken on the football field, right? This is the reason why ain't nobody uh, called him out, has called him in to try to work out him in this, in this regard because of stats, right? Now, for the 2016 season, the man went had 2,241 yards, right? His comp was 196, PCT 590.21, but 2,241 yards, right? That ain't nothing. Look, four interceptions, right? 16 touchdowns. This ain't nothing. 16 touchdowns for 2,221 yards. That ain't nothing, right? The average quarterbacks are getting more than that, okay? Then we look at 2015. And by the way, 2016, they only won one game. 2015, they only won two games, and this is the year Tom Sula had to bench him, right? Look at that, 1,615 yards. And I don't want to hear that the team sucks. He sucked too. And I'm just showing y'all that, right? Look at five interceptions for only six touchdowns, right? 7-1 first downs, right? This is why, look at rating 78.5. He sucks, dude. He's not that damn good at all. This is why most most coaches, most GMs, most presidents ain't trying to sign Conor Kaepernick because he doesn't fit in with most football teams at all. None. Okay? Y'all gotta understand it. Madden is only doing this for money. Because Madden know they screwed up already when the games were released. Because people are saying, hashtag drop EA. EA is doing anything they can to try to get people to continue to play a game because they're desperate right now. But they're willing to lie on the NFL. Lie on Colin Kaepernick in that regard. He's not a top free agent at all. He's just not. Now, this is what Anthony Lynn had to say, right? Now, Anthony Lynn was going was talking about possibly bringing him in to work out with him, right? To work out with the football team this summer. But this is what he says, right? Because he did announce that they wanted to bring Kyle again, Kyle Captain in for a workout. That still has we don't know if that's even happened yet. But this is what he had to say, right? He said he fits the style of quarterback that we want, Lynn said during a Zoom conference with media. We're happy with the three quarterbacks that we have. But you can't have enough on the runway. Lynn added that the NF that he hasn't spoken to Kaepernick and that a workout hasn't been scheduled. Okay? Again, let me repeat that. Lynn added that he hasn't spoken to Kaepernick and that a workout hasn't been scheduled. Every NFL team root routinely brings in players while consistently tweaking their rosters. But of course, Kaepernick, who hasn't played in the NFL since the 2016 season after launching a protest movement, Aimed towards raise awareness about police brutality and other social iniquities that afflict people of color isn't just any free agent. But again, nobody has brought him in yet. And now you know why. I just showed y'all them two seasons. Not to mention the season before, right? In 2014, this is when they went, this when they went, when they moved out of Candlestick and moved to Santa Clara, right? Yeah, he had 3,369 yards, right? He had that, right? But 10 interceptions. Okay, so he had 10 picks. 10 interceptions, right? His rating was on 86.4. He's not that good, man. 
He's not that good at all. And that team went 8-8. Eight eight. That Kaepernick basically did a Tony Romo and made um, Jim Harbaugh look like Jason Garrett. All right? Again, that's why he's not signed anymore. The 49ers never want him to leave. He opted out of a contract. He basically told the 49ers, I quit. Okay, that's his own fault. And uh, and then let me, let me show you why he, the real reason, the other reason why he not, he's not in the league, because he don't want it, right? Now, let's look at this. Now, this is what, um, now this is according to Google, right? This is how much is Colin Kaepernick worth now? Colin Kaepernick's net worth and salary. According to Celebrity Network, Colin Kaepernick's net worth figure currently stands at an estimated $20 million. All right? It says, how much money did Kaepernick get from Nike? Despite initial reports, the deal included a guaranteed $61 million. According to Business Side, Kaepernick only received approximately $39.4 million, roughly 31% of the amount that was initially touted. And this is not even talk about the money he got from the settlement, which he never told anybody. Right? And Kaepernick just got a Nike deal. The man don't care about playing football no more. I'm going to tell you that right now. If Kaepernick was really... Really, truly wanted to play football, that man would have been on somebody's football field already. That man would have been apologized, right, for how he did the Ravens, how he did Ray Lewis, right? How he, uh, the whole drama between the 49ers and him and all the Smith. That man would have been, would have been getting an interview, right? He would have been on first take when Steve A. Smith invited him, Nettie, him, Ness Nitty, and Eric Reed. Ness Nitty would have had him on Hot 97 doing interviews. This man don't care about playing football no more. Like, I don't know why Manny even decided to add him on there. Ain't nobody going to take him. He himself don't want to play no more. Now you know why. Now you know what's taking Colin Kaepernick so long to get back to Lee. He does not care about playing in the NFL ever again. He don't. And I'm ready for Colin Kaepernick to say out his own mouth, I don't want to play football. I appreciate the offer, but I don't want to play football no more. I'm doing other things with my life. I'm focused on other issues. Colin Kaepernick don't need the NFL money anymore. He just don't. And another reason why Colin Kaepernick don't want to come back to the league, uh, honestly, the man don't have no um, confidence to try to battle. So he want to battle out other quarterbacks. He don't want to battle out Tyrod Taylor with the Chargers. He don't want to battle out Lamar Jackson with the Ravens. That's the real reason why he didn't sign with him. And not because of Joe Flacco. It's because they was going to tell him you got to battle out Lamar Jackson. Right? He's not going to be Russell Wilson's backup because of pride. Russell Wilson messed up his chances of returning back to the Super Bowl to try to win one. He's not going to back up no Russell Wilson. That's the way he didn't want to sign with Seattle in the first place. Again, I've been telling you all for the last four years what this is really about. All man is trying to do, managers want money. That's all they want. They doing anything to try to get people people to play the game. Knowing how bad... Because put Adam Colin Kaepernick back into, uh, back into Madden is not going to fix the problems Madden has. Right? And then, that, and then the people who wrote this, whoever wrote the statement, don't watch football. Again... EA need to fire that whole um staff. EA needs to let go of a lot of people, man. A lot of people need to lose their jobs. EA need to start from scratch. They need a whole new development team. I'm going to tell you that right now. No, Colin Kaepernick ain't going to sign with no white football team because Colin Kaepernick don't want to uh, play football no more. He just don't. Right? All Kaepernick doing is milking the fact that people keep bringing up his name. The man don't ain't going to sign with nobody's football field no more. He ain't. And ain't no football team going to give him the money he wants anyway. They not. And I just showed you again. Y'all need to go look up the last three seasons he played in, even before he took the knee. As far as I'm concerned, he really don't deserve to be in the NFL no more. This man that called out Jay-Z, right? They had Nas Nitty called um, Travis Scott, Glass Knight, and Big Boy sellouts for performing the Super Bowl, right? When they were just trying to uh, feed their families and provide for their bills, right? This is this man has caused a whole lot of drama. Not to mention, the prayers coach Lynch don't want him around either. So no, Madden lied. They lied big time, right? They lied, the truth ain't in them. Colin Kaepernick's not a top free agent at all. Under any circumstance, he's not. He don't deserve that 81 overall rating. That's a lie, right? They just do it not just to get you to play the game. No. Is people going to be adding Colin Kaepernick to a team? You know, he's not He's not currently signed, right? Now, Anthony Lynn ain't, ain't talked to this dude at all. He just showed you, right? So this is, again, that told you the media is willing to lie to, break, to make Kaepernick look good. No, man, I don't, I'm not getting this. This ain't, this is not encouraged. I would suggest nobody buy, don't buy Madden 21. Don't buy it until, uh, until you get the PS5. Because they don't care about this game at all. They don't. Right? They got a lazy ass development team. Excuse my language, man, but it, this is just how I feel. They develop a team that's lazy. They didn't put no effort at all. 
Because first of all, man, ain't most of everybody ain't gonna have no PS5 like that. I show sure not. They don't care at all. So I'm here to clear it up. This proves most of the people working with EA, they don't watch the NFL at all. They don't watch the NFL Sunday. They don't watch Monday Night Football. They don't watch none of the news that's been happening in the last four years. The NFL gave Colin Kaepernick a chance to work out and try out for these teams. This man wouldn't sign a contract and he did his own workout, right? Back in January, right? Long before the coronavirus hit, all right? He don't care no more, right? Start bringing up his name. Start mentioning him. He don't care about playing football. That's it. He don't care no more. Y'all need to leave this alone. Let it be. But anyway, folks, that's the video, man. Like, subscribe, comment, like, man. Y'all stay blessed. Stay tuned. I'll see you soon.